Hey, how's it going? Today we're going to go over how to draw uh, the main character from the Bad Guys uh, animated movie. Main character is a wolf. Uh, pretty cool movie. I haven't, uh, you know, seen the whole thing, but I'm going to watch the whole thing later. Uh, but yeah, I encourage you to stick around. This is going to be very, very simple. So if you're brand new and if you're a beginner, you will be able to do this with me, okay? Uh, before anything else, I post every single day here. So hit the subscribe and click the bell notifications for all kinds of cool beginner lessons. Every single lesson's around like below 10 minutes, so usually like eight minutes. All right, let's jump in right now. Let's go over to draw Mr. Wolf here from Bad Guys. All right. First thing I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna go around the snout area. So I'm gonna pull like maybe a line here for the top of the nose real quick. And uh, from here I'm gonna pull a line for the top of the snout. All right. Right here I'm gonna pull another line for the top of his eye region. So with his eye over here, I'm gonna draw the bottom part of the eye. So it's gonna swoop, like so. Go over here to the front, down, back, curve, Down over here, the bottom of the snout, and I'm gonna curve back. Back over here. Right on. Pull up over here. And line out for the far side. Curve, curve. Right on. If anybody saw the bad guys, let me know in the comments. I'm curious what you thought of the movie. I'm gonna go over here and I'm gonna curve for the inner eye there, or for the eyeball. I'm sorry, the uh, pupil and iris there. Fill it in, fill it in. Except for a highlight. <clears throat> Okey doke. Gonna go over here and line for the eyebrow. Edge of the, the far side of the eyebrow is going to be bigger, so kind of keep that in mind. And I'm going to connect it down here, connect it up here. Curve here for the furrowing of the brow. Going to do the same thing on the far end right here. Same eyebrow shape. Go over here out. Curve down, Some far side of the head. Then over here, I'm gonna open his mouth a little bit. It's gonna close back up almost like right here. And then that's gonna curve around the bottom and we're gonna curve it along the bottom here. Okay. And let's go to the top of the head over here. So top of the head, right there, pulling out for the brow, top of the head. Okay. Over here on this side, out, down for one ear. Pulling a little bit of a zigzag for the top of the hair, top of the head. Out over here, down. Pulling down over here. Zigzag for kind of the outer part of the cheek there. And then that's gonna pull in over here. All right. So far we got like a general wolf head, it's going pretty good. Don't forget, hit the like button if you like videos like this. Um, I'm gonna go over here, line, it takes two seconds, less than a second to press the like. I'm gonna go over here and throw a line across. He's gonna have pretty flat teeth. So we're just gonna like draw a line, 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 line there for his teeth. Cool. Let's go over here for to get his inner ear, all right? So on the bottom, 
it's gonna be a triangle shape, but on the bottom, it's gonna be a little bit of a zigzag right there. Then pull up, down. Okay. Gonna go over here, he's got a, a pattern here. Line, down, that's gonna be a, just the shape, right, of the pattern of the uh, fur there, the color of the fur. Line down here, line down here for his suit. Go over here on this side, I'm gonna pull down, down, because that's his collar, far side collar. Down over here, other, other collar. I'm gonna go over here and pull line out. Over here, line out, top of his shoulders there. And now, pull line down for a side of his shoulder. Over here as well, side of the shoulder. Down the middle here. Down the center. And now let's go over here. Down, in. Over here on this side. Down, in. All right, let's go over here that edge of the suit, like the collar of the actual blazer. We're gonna pull another line out, like a V shape in. Continue to go downward here. So let's do that shape over here on this side. So it's gonna pull down, V shape in, down over here. Over here on this side, line down. Over here on this side, line down. Down here, over here, down here. Cool, cool. Let's do some buttons here. Just some dots down one side of the shirt there. And let's go to the nose over here. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna throw a curved line on the nose, flatten it out, and then fill in the rest. Okay, doing good so far? You good? Right on. And maybe put like a thin line over here on the edge of the mouth. But that's pretty much it, honestly. That's like, outside of the color, I guess you could fill in his eyebrows as well. If you're doing this in pencil, the same thing. It doesn't matter what you do this in. I just like marker because it shows up better on the page. And right here, if you want to throw more, you can throw like another zigzag on the side of his cheek there to give it some texture. Um, and that is it. I really hope you enjoyed that. I hope that was easy for you. And uh, yeah, if you enjoyed that, like I said, hit that like button. Also share the video. When you share the video, it does a lot to boost the channel. Um, you guys are awesome. And I, you know, everybody's been here for a long time and I, I'm very grateful. Super, super grateful. Thank you guys. I'll talk to you next time. Hey, for those of you that are a little bit more serious and you really wanna kind of upgrade your art skill all around, uh, I have these beginner art lessons here on my Skillshare. So the idea with this is that some people that, you know, for example, on YouTube, people just kinda wanna draw what's in the video and just generally have a fun time. They're not always concerned about the little details and stuff about learning uh, how to do this stuff, you know, long-term. Um, and I get that, that's fun. But for some people, some people want to upgrade their art ability entirely, like all around, like they're serious about it. If that's you, go here. Um, like I said, there's programs here on even some of the same material. Like I said, it's just a lot more in depth. My eye drawing program is an hour as opposed to the video I have on YouTube, which is like 10 minutes, right? You can still learn from both. But like I said, if you really want more and you really want to make this part of your life, go here. Um, I have same thing over here, how to draw a dragon head. I have anime, I have cartoons. There's categories for everything and everything is for beginners. Um, the other thing about this website is it's incredibly easy to watch it. This is like the Netflix of like drawing lessons. So you can go through the entire site, see everybody else's lessons. And normally the, the site costs like 30 to 40 bucks a month. Um, because you're watching this video right now, if you're still watching right now, you get it for free for at least a month like 30 days, that's a lot. Um, but just you, what you have to do is go over here to the video, go down first link in the description, the very, very first link that gives you free access to this whole thing for 30 days. Um, you just go over here, you click this thing, 
boom, and then you sign up. Um, and it's super easy, and the, the cool part is you can just straight up cancel it before the 30 days is up, and you never pay a single thing. You never pay a cent, and you got all this learning from it. Uh, but yeah, like I said, that's uh, an option for you guys. Uh, if you guys want to do it, absolutely go hit that up. Um, and that's it. So talk to you later, and uh, hopefully I'll see, I'll catch you over there later. Thank you so much. You are amazing. Uh, over here on the right, you're going to see my most recent upload. And on the top corner over here, you're going to see just another selection, another cool selection that has to do kind of with the subject of this video. Uh, and over here at the top, you can hit the subscribe to see a lot more. Uh, this is awesome, and I'll see you next time.